hepatitis is uh, globally we have over 304 million uh, cases of hepatitis both B and C and uh, hepatitis uh, B is about 253 million globally and um, C is about 50 million um, annually we have about uh, in Kenya we have we have about 1.9 million uh, um, patients with uh, with hepatitis so one of the the three counties one of the three counties that has a high prevalence of hepatitis B is actually Baringo at 11.9 percent we have Turkana at about 16.8 percent and uh, Migori at 10 percent um, so we decided to to come here and celebrate this day in Baringo County to just uh, highlight what hepatitis is all about and to create awareness so that we can have um, our population in Baringo and Kenya at large be aware that uh, hepatitis is there. Uh, so what we're doing is we realize that um, as you have mentioned rightly that there is uh, less awareness about the hepatitis and therefore the Minister of Health through NASCOP has decided to set up a unit which uh, solely primarily focuses on viral hepatitis so that there is always uh, when we're on the table there's always a conversation on viral hepatitis and we're just basically about one year old I know the program NASCOP has actually been uh, having hepatitis activities uh, for uh, hepatitis C for the people who inject drugs uh, test and treat and uh, also in the PMTCT that is elimination of uh, mother to child transmission we have the triple elimination agenda where we are um, eliminating HIV syphilis and hepatitis B uh, however the conversations were just in that you know in that population so setting up this unit is going to you know have a focal person a voice at the table and also it is going to assist us in creating awareness uh, we are currently as a unit updating our uh, 2018 guidelines and uh, with that then uh, you know with with the local context and with the current global trends uh, so that we can be able to you know update and be at par with what's happening globally Mm, considering our Kenyan co context of course and then of course uh, we are also going to be having a lot of awareness campaigns so that uh, it's not overshadowed kwa sababu kulingana na vile imeua watu pande hii baringo imeua watu wengi sana ukisikia huyu ameaga hepatitis b hapa kidogo tunaenda mashishe hepatitis b mpaka machifu walikuwa hata wanategenesa barasa hiyo ndio kitu ilikuwa inatangazwa mimi nikasema sasa mimi nimeenda mimi nimeenda kabisa na watoto yangu hey. ni naanza hata daktari anajaribu kuniongelesha hata kuniambia we unaitwa nani jina ilishapotea sijitambui uh, sisi tulikuwa tunajua hii ugonjwa ni urogi na ilisemekana hii urogi inabebwa na makucha hiyo dawa mtu akikukuta ukikula anakuwekea kwa chakula sasa ndio nilikuwa nachiuliza mimi nilitembelea mkutano gani ama sherehe gani ndio nimewekewa hii uchawi Hakuna mtu alikuwa naamini hepatitis B ni ugonjwa ambaye iko na viini vyake kitafauti. Walielewa ni uchawi. Hata mimi saa hiyo nilikuwa ninajua tu nimerogwa. Na hakuna dawa ya uchawi. Nilikuwa nimeamini tu sasa mimi ninaenda. Si tuliamini ugonjwa unajua ilianzia upande wa Loboy huko Torais. Sasa ikasemekana hii ni ugonjwa ya Torais. Sasa ulikuwa ukienda hata unajua sasa tunaenda huko mimi ni mfanye biashara. Mimi naenda huko ninanunua hata mahindi ninanunua naingia kwa hoteli. Sasa nilifikiria labda wakati eh, nilienda huko niliwekewa hiyo dawa. Alafu huyu jirani nilijua tu hata yeye pia amerogwa. Kwa sababu kitu ina, inakufurisha tumbo, usikii uchungu yeyote hata ukiuliza ni wapi ni chungu, hasemi. Nikukua week 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 na hasemi mahali na muma. Mimi nikashindwa. Si watu waniambie tu kama wamenipata na HIV. Si waniambie tu kuliko wanifiche. Hii dawa yenye ninaona ni ile ya watu wenye wako na ugonjwa ya ukimwi. Na mbona mimi ninapewa na ninaambiwa ni hepatitis B. And uh, Baringo happens to be one of the counties that has the highest burden of um, hepatitis. Uh, currently we are talking about close to 700 people on treatment in uh, Baringo County. Um, of these 700, 
Uh, 12 of them are mothers who are either expectant or breastfeeding. And uh, we know that uh, there is always the possibility of uh, transmission of uh, hepatitis to the unborn baby uh, or thereafter. So in the county, the areas that are so much affected by hepatitis burden is majorly Marigat, Mogotio, uh, Baringo North, and uh, Tiati sub-counties. Uh, we can say it is more prevalent in the lowlands. It's more prevalent in the lowlands. When you look at uh, the distribution of the disease and what one would call an upsurge, an upsurge just happens when uh, in a certain village or community, uh, numbers of people who are brought to hospital and uh, die or they are diagnosed to have had hepatitis um, kind of informs a narrative that there is an outbreak. While in essence it isn't an outbreak. It's just that the numbers um, have gone up in terms of those who are reported. In terms of burden, Baringo is classified as hepatitis endemic area meaning that it's a disease that is always there in the community. Um, like I've said, we have about 700 who are currently on treatment, and some of them are antenatal mothers and postnatal who are breastfeeding, and they're all on treatment. Um, we are not in a position to give the incidences because for the incidences, we have to do a research. Uh, and we are reaching out to partners, implementers, who can support us in research that will give us the actual figures in terms of incidences. As myths actually carry misinformation because myths in most cases are not factual. They are not science grounded. So you'll find that people will say maybe they were bewitched, maybe they need to go for um, alternative medicine, they have to go for herbalist interventions, some go for prayers, interventions, but at the long run, they don't really make much difference in terms of um, uh, treatment. Ultimately, scientific approach to treatment is what wins. So we need to send out the right messages out there so that we, do de we, we demystify the talks out there. Remember, people tend to believe myths more than facts, especially if facts and information, the right information is not gone out. Hey, what are you doing? I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the 
Asa, na ile uli, na zile ulitoa asubuhi. Leona ulirusha mahali zingine kama zilikuwa zimeisha. Eh. Siku ya maini Siku ya oma ya ini Ama appetite is B Sherey na itimizu Kuzima Thank you.